the urgent push to production. The success of the demonstrator paves the way for the program to enter the critical engineering and manufacturing development, EMD, phase. During this next stage, a company or companies will be awarded a contract to finalize the design and build the flyable prototype of the actual NGAD fighter. Secretary Kendall has repeatedly framed NGAD as the Air Force's top acquisition priority, essential for countering China's rapidly modernizing PLA Air Force. He has often stated that the U.S. must leverage its current technological advantage, warning that the window of opportunity is closing. The NGAD program is not just a single aircraft, but a system of systems, which will include a piloted quarterback fighter, the F-47, operating alongside a fleet of unmanned collaborative combat aircraft, CCAs, all connected by advanced networks. With the demonstrator's flights complete and the program moving forward, the U.S. Air Force has taken its most concrete step yet toward making the once futuristic concept of the F-47 NGAD a battlefield reality. Conclusion The F-47's progress marks a visible step forward in the U.S. pursuit of next-generation air dominance. By initiating production and locking in a 2028 first flight goal, the USAF is reinforcing the narrative that it intends to remain the benchmark in aerial warfare. Whether it will dominate in operational terms will depend on how well the technologies integrate, how rapidly the aircraft can be fielded and sustained, and how adversaries respond.